Welcome, kids. In the heart of the African savanna, the sun rose on a kingdom where lions ruled. This is the story of the Lion King. The journey begins with a radiant sunrise, painting the pride lands with hues of gold and orange, signaling the start of a new day. Meet big strong lion named Mufasa and a lovely lioness named Sarabi. They're the king and queen of a special place called the Pride Lands. One day, they show everyone their cute new baby lion, Simba. All the animals come together under a big rock called Pride Rock to celebrate this happy moment. Young Simba, who is a little lion, likes to have fun. He jumps around and plays with bugs. Simba's days were filled with laughter and adventure. He laughed a lot and went on exciting adventures. At the very top of Pride Rock, Mufasa, the wise king, talks to Simba about important things. He says that in nature, everything is linked like a big puzzle and we need to take care of it to keep the balance of life just right. It's like making sure all the pieces fit perfectly in a big circle called the circle of life. But hiding in the dark, there's a lion named Scar. Scar is the cunning and power-hungry brother of Mufasa. He talks to some bad hyenas and they make a mean plan together. Something really, really sad happens to little Simba. It shattered him. He sees his dad, Mufasa, get hurt by a big, wild rush of animals running together. It's a very scary and sad moment for Simba. Simba, feeling really sorry and sad, goes off all by himself into a very harsh and lonely desert. He's trying to figure out who he really is and what he should do. With his new pals, Timon and Pumbaa, Simba discovers a happy way of living called Hakuna Matata, which means not to worry about things. They have so much fun together, even dancing under the beautiful African night sky, full of twinkling stars, without any worries or problems. Simba meets his old friend, Nala, who he knew when he was a kid. Seeing her again makes him feel really hopeful. It makes him believe he can become the king he's supposed to be and make the Pride Lands a great place again. Simba grew up and became a strong and brave lion. He goes back to Pride Rock, which is his home, to deal with some old problems and stand up to Scar, who did some bad things. In the big final fight, Simba and his friends fought really hard against Scar's mean followers. And guess what? Simba and his friends won, and Simba got to be the king again, just like he should be. And in a heartwarming moment, Simba and Nala, who are now all grown up, proudly present their own newborn cub. This special moment reminds everyone that life goes on, just like a circle of life, and it makes everyone happy. As the day comes to an end in the Pride Lands, something wonderful happens. Everything becomes peaceful and happy again. It's like all the pieces of life fit perfectly together, making everything even more beautiful than before. And so ends the timeless story of The Lion King, a tale of courage, redemption and the eternal circle of life. A timeless tale of The Lion King will always remain in our hearts.